Good morning to you both. Yes, we're in the historical town of Malden today, which is famous for its salt and also its riverside. I'm going to be taking you there shortly, but for now, we're in my childhood dream. We're in a real-life chocolate factory. So good morning to you. You are live on TV and radio. Do you want to introduce yourself and tell us where we are? Yeah, my name's Sonia. Um, welcome to Tempered. Um, this is all our amazing chocolate. We have 14 flavours. Yeah, so show us some of these flavours. This is incredible. Yeah, this is our Malden Sea Salt bar. This is uh, our standard bar. And then we have this one, which is our dark honeycomb. This is our large bar. So you are a family-run business. You're, yeah. you're already very, very popular. You haven't actually been running that long, though, have you? No. No, we launched in November 20, so we've been going 20 months now. And uh, the internet was brilliant in the start because, obviously, it was in lockdown. So everybody was buying their treats online. It was doing really, really well. And uh, now we do markets and events and things like that. And we've actually really expanded already, and it's only been 20 months. Yeah, already double the size. Yeah. Absolutely fantastic. And good morning. Hello. Good morning. I'm Carla. I'm brand manager here. And would you like to see where the magic happens? Yes, please. I thought you'd never ask. Yes, so we're going to go in this the real life chocolate factory now, yes? Yes. Incredible. Yes. Good morning, good morning. So tell us, talk us through this factory. So we um, start the morning about 7 o'clock. We load this machine up with chocolate. This is our dark chocolate machine. So wow. we pour in callets, let it melt, and then this tempers it for us. I wish you guys had smell vision, Eamon and Rosie. It smells absolutely incredible in here. Here's the milk chocolate one. This is a bit bigger. Obviously, we make more milk chocolate. So this is like a huge machine. This does a 60 kilos of chocolate. <laughs> Wow, it just looks so smooth and incredible. It's lovely. <laughs> we, um, we use our, we pour the chocolate from there, we pour them into our bespoke moulds. We had these designed for us. Um, we then set the chocolate in the fridges and we come out with this as our final product. So we've got a lovely looking bar, really shiny. It snaps nicely because of the temper. So how was that during the, the heat wave, the 40 well, degrees? The good thing about making it in here is that we are 20 degrees in here with aircon, but selling it's a problem because it starts to melt. So we did some events where it started to get a bit soft, but it's, we've coped quite well, to be honest, our first sort of big summer. You're well prepared, fantastic. Yeah. And then you, you go to packaging. Yeah, this is a, a foiled bar. So the next step would be foiling. These are all hand foiled. We use recyclable packaging as well, so not all of it can be recycled. And these are our wrappers, hand wrapped. And then we end up with a final product which looks... Something like that. Wow. So what is your most uh, popular bar of chocolate? Molden sea salt and caramel. We're obviously based in Molden. We use Molden sea salt. This is our biggest seller. It sells double everything else. Um, and it's a fantastic product. So great. And uh, Molden sea salt have also been brilliant. And on our next run of packaging, they're going to let us use their font and their um, logo. Oh, brilliant. So two kind of Molden businesses coming together. That's brilliant. Really, really good. So I do want to ask you about the cost of living, because obviously this is a luxury chocolate. I mean, we can see here you've got a gift box here. That's, I think you said it was 500 grams of pure chocolate there. So it yep. looks lovely. But, you know, cost of living, people aren't going to be buying luxury chocolate, are you? Are they? Is that something that's worrying you? Not really. We plan to keep our prices the same, um, and we are an affordable artisan luxury product, so we're a nice affordable treat in hard times. Yes, and people are going to need a treat, aren't they? I think so, yeah, especially when things are so hard. What better than chocolate? What better than chocolate? I mean, I'm a literally massive chocolate fan. May I try some? It's now the taste test. I mean, it would be rude not to, right? So this is your most popular bar. This is molten sea salt and caramel. I've got that right? Yeah, okay. I've got a big chunk here. Wow. <laughs> that is sweet and salty incredible amazing Amy and Rosie I bet you wish you were here right this is incredible it smells amazing so I'm going to get back to the chocolate now and then I'll take you down to the river in a little bit